Hi, my name is Dave Tyler and I'm an audio application specialist at Avid. We've seen lots of new features added to Pro Tools over the past year as we continually develop and improve the software. Here are some of the important features that we've added for our users who work in the field of TV and film post-production. Probably the most significant addition to Pro Tools in 2017 for post-production is the integration of Dolby Atmos. Avid and Dolby have worked in close partnership to enable this integration. 7.1.2 tracks busing and panning result in a slick integrated workflow for anyone working with Dolby Atmos for film or TV. Another area of post-production that's getting a lot of attention is audio for virtual reality. We have enabled VR workflows by adding first, second and third order ambisonics tracks and busing to allow third parties to provide VR audio tools right inside Pro Tools. 2017 brought full support for Pro Tools streaming audio directly from Avid's Nexus shared storage. You can now stream up to 256 tracks and connect up to 12 Pro Tools systems and you get faster disk caching when working with larger projects. The workspace got some updates including a new tagged search. You can now tag your sound effects and easily filter your searches to find the right sound for the job. The new battery name window offers a really powerful way of manipulating track and click names. And scroll to track name enables you to quickly find the track in the session that you want to work on by just typing in the name. You can get access to all these features by getting the latest version of Pro Tools HD when you head over to shop.avid.com.